All right. Now we're doing free code camp, responsive web design, learn HTML by building a cat photo app, step 62. All right. So now we will add a footer section to the page. After the main element, we're going to add a footer element. All right. So let's check out footer over here at uh, W3 school. So we'll say footer HTML, uh, W3 schools right here. And for the definition and usage, the footer tag defines a footer for the document or section. The footer element typically contains authorship information, copyright information, contact information, a site map, uh, back to top links, and also related documents. Uh, we can have several footer elements in one document, all right? And for the tip, uh, contact information inside a footer element should go inside an address tag, all right? We'll probably cover address later. Uh, let's check out a uh, example for it. <laughs> well, that's not too much. <laughs> anyway, so that if that was at the bottom of the page, it'd be one thing, but it's not. So anyway, this is the kind of stuff that would be in a footer. Uh, let's come over here. And so we're going to start off by having an opening footer tag like this footer and then closing footer tag like this footer like that. All right. And nothing's happened so far, but uh, when we check it, it looks good and submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 62. Pardon me, step 63. And we'll see you next time.